Imagine finding a treasure chest full of money. In this week's parasha, in parasha Matsura, we're going to learn all about that building from a Rashi, from a Medrash, that when the Jews are going to come into the land of Israel, their houses are going to be inflicted with a spiritual leprosy of Tsarat over here. And it's what's it going to result in having to knock down the walls of the house and break it down. God forbid. However, why does Tsarat come with spiritual leprosy? Because of several different Averot being haughty, for example, seeing, being stingy and also speaking malice, uh, bad, bad gossip over here. And at the end, it leads to Tsarat, the spiritual leprosy. But it can come in the form of houses also. It can actually be inflicted on one's house also, God forbid. And how do we see this in this week's parish? We know the Canaanites, when they were living in Israel, before they ran away, they buried uh, a lot of their treasure chests and all their money inside the walls of the house. And in this week's parish, we learn that if, that when, God forbid, they do the transgression of one of these uh, big Averot, they actually have to knock down the walls of the house at the end, cut, exit the house itself. And what did they find? They found the treasure coins. They found, found the treasure chest over here, which was uh, buried underneath. What a prize! We get a prize! Uh, for doing teshuva, and that's the real prize in life, is teshuva, is repentance. Hashem gives us this uh, reward of repentance, so that we, we, we do an introspection, we're really, really sorry, and at the end, if we do full teshuva, we get, get wiped away the Averot, and that's a real treasure.